Chase Julian back with more Bowser Quints. Let's see who we are playing today. Let's try to give it one more randomly spin. Randomly? Random spin on the uh, other half person there. Let's see, hopefully we get someone we haven't gotten yet. Okay, I'm fine. You know, I want to play more Bethany anyway because I played her last run. And uh, we're going to random her twice. So we're going up this time in Polaroid. And we did Mega Satan. We can do Boss Rush, maybe Hush. And then go with the chest. That's our basic our plan so far. <laughs> um, and yeah, actually, I looked at the stat or the opening screen. It says worse items or weaker items. As, uh, you know, it's not even really worth it. I'm, I'm just not going to hold that. Um, like I'm saying, it says weaker items, right? And uh, so, like, last run, I felt like we had a lot of good items, actually. Like, not even just... It, a lot of our fires got, got destroyed, actually. A lot of our wisps. Didn't even have that many um, remaining. But, yeah. I mean, I want to buy a Spirit Heart. But, uh, I feel like even now, I feel like this is a good item, too. Is it always take? No. But, you know, there's something about when you see all milk sitting there by itself. In the first item of the game. But, like, am I really going to say no to this first item? Or... Is this kind of defining the rest of the run? Like, is this going to be like, you know, I feel like most Isaac videos or most Isaac runs, you kind of get, oh shit, all right, that was, that was horrible. At first, how, how happened? I, I got caught on the fucking, that's right, at first there, on the rock, so I uh, couldn't couldn't walk through it. And I got hit. Anyway, I think I was saying, I think uh, it's a weird item to pick up like midway through your run because you're not like, like, sure, like, hey, am I really gonna? Room what I had, maybe it's me better. But this is starter run, you know, like most days of starter run, it's like the, the whole run is affected by this. It's like basically colored by this uh, item. Colored as in, like, I don't know, the theming of the, of the run. So, he bombs, you money. Should not, got, that should not have gotten hit, but you know, do have low damage for now. Hoping to uh, eventually have more than, what's that, 1.5? Yeah. Oh, more some. Um, losing a little chubby did suck, I know. It, it was kind of doing more damage than I was doing already, but I think we're just going to go to our double deal here. Our double deal? What? No. Our boss fight here, top double card. And then hopefully kill it quickly. I I don't know. Pageant Boy, is that fine? Honestly, I've heard Pageant Boy is a tier zero quality item. Maybe it, it, I could get it more likely as this character now. Right. Like my, hits, my shots hit you? Right. And... I see almond milk with like two damage. You may think it's only like, oh, it's only one more damage than, than, than two or one. One is, you know, one plus one is two, but it, it's it's a it's exponential. You know, every single shot's doing more damage. So, the more I hit, obviously, the better it is. And uh, you are a champion. I Meaning, if I get hit by you, I'll say this. If I get hit by you, then I lose a full heart. But if I kill you, I think I get one. I think I, think I get a spirit heart as a reward. Yeah, this is probably a, a good boss using for or for using Devil Card on, also. And maybe you also want to use early Lemmingtons. Think about it. All right, that's well, all the rest of this floor. Yeah. Going to the chest. Going to Boss Rush, hopefully. Because Boss Rush with Lemmington should just be awesome, right? <clears throat> I do realize now that Lemmington can only be passives, which makes sense, obviously. Um. But yeah, I don't know. I'll just keep an eye out for the, the lower quality items, because uh, so far, I don't know. I, I, I guess Almond Milk can be considered one. It's not always good. I think right now we're in a unique position where it's like it's fine, because we, we have starting stats, and, you know, even though they're lower, we can build up from here. So I'm not, like, that scared. I'm like, I can probably get a damage grade or two. Maybe another, another um, Hell card, maybe? But yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm a sucker. I keep, like, hoarding my, uh, my red hearts. You know what? Let's pop it. Sure. I mean, that's the thing. Splunker's hat, it's not necessarily like a damage upgrade or anything, but it is going to give me so much information, like so much where the secret rooms are. So yeah, just, just having these other items like, around is nice. Definitely want to use it as much as possible. Don't want to save up. Like, what, what could I do? I could get a spear, uh, uh, sorry, a spacebar item, and then, you know, like the D6, D100, D infinity of the last one, and just use that for my red hearts. But, I could also, um... Could also use it on my passive items, and then uh, you know, hopefully get a bunch of them. I don't know when it caps out though. Is it 16? Is it 20? Is it 30? Is it 40? I've no idea. I'd love to be like infinite, but should probably check that out. 
I know normally you have like a certain amount per type of, of uh, a wisp. So I don't know how limited works with that exactly. Also, we missed an item room. So, a secret room right here. So now all these bombs missed the opening. But, you know, what can you do? Paid for itself. And yeah, let's get more charges. Let's get the um, I guess the shop. You just peek in. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I, I, whenever I see a spirit heart, I'm like, why not? Why not buy it? If I can afford it, buy it. It's basically like you know, well, a box of friends it could work. I, I, I see what you're saying there. It's like one or two box of friends. Eh. Uh, okay. Well, honestly, this is cool. I never really used it for this before, but a Splunker's cap is or Splunker's hat is not telling me going down is actually kind of pointless. Like, sure, curse rooms there, or whatever, but like. I didn't realize that the see-through doors thing actually did. I lost my uh, my range upgrade. Oh no! So then with my cap, not spoiling this cap. I think it also may provide some light in the darkness. You love me some of that. Sure. I got this next boss. I guess kill. And yeah. So anyway, point is, it's better than I thought it was. I think I got buffed somehow. I definitely didn't do this before. With the well, okay, pre-repentance. Which, by the way, is over a year ago now, so... Maybe I should check, check out how old I'm getting at this point. Uh, I mean... <clears throat> so... Remember... Weaker items. <laughs> now, that being said, I do only have... Um, one damage. So... I mean, is it gonna do that much? I mean, yes, because it, I didn't have it before. Now I do have it, therefore meaning that... You know... It's going to give me more than than I had before, but I guess on a regular run, Infestation would do more damage because you'd have more damage already, and it multiplies your damage, so... Yeah. Oh, Box of Friends, you say? Well, I do have a cube of meat. I don't know. I'll pick it up. Maybe, you know what? I had the choice there between Box of Friends and the, the Trinket Box. But I thought it more through. I thought it through better, more. I'm not sure how to say that exactly. Also, you should get me this. <laughs> get got. Crows. Attack. Easy. Um, don't need the Mega Satan anymore. So, sure, it's in here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, nice, nice joke. These are definitely bad items. So, I can say that as much. I've gotten some, some weaker, quote-unquote, items from Bethany in the, in the Devil Room, but... Honestly, the items are pretty good. Both Almond Milk and uh, Infestation, that's very good. Even the... Every item we have, in my opinion, yeah, right now is good. Every single one. So it's odd that, like, I haven't actually gotten any bad items before. Aside from the ones I didn't pay for, obviously. You know, just because Satan's offering it doesn't mean I have to take it. So. Yeah, it's not coming. Ooh. It's done on the championship. This is an annoying room because, like, I, I can't control my tears, really. <clears throat> and, uh, do low damage. And, uh, oh shit, my Splunker's hat. And, ooh, I got some juicy sack, at least. Thing is, using spiders. I thought the sack was just, like, slowing effect, but I guess it does give you occasional spiders, too. And yeah, like, this first room, not too encouraging. Um, but they are enemies that are kind of against us. We have to wait for them to open. We have some moment of actually attacking. When we do, we get, like, two damage in. That's it. You'll probably heal yourself too, like as I thought. I guess. No, no, I didn't. So usually it's like a zombie uh, transformation or champion. You know. But yeah, I mean, for now we're just gonna keep on stacking up L L Lemmington. I also didn't see you there. I mean, I guess it's, it's just good enemy design. But like, do you have to spawn right behind me? Like, like, because I don't know. Is it fair? I feel like it's weird that enemies just, they can just do that, I don't know. Not even that, like, they, well, I mean, I guess it could just be random luck. I'm not trying to be a, a, a complainer about this. I'm like, they, but they, they're targeting me, and then as they, like, put themselves in a space behind me, like, come on, why? Just choose where you're going, and then sure, from there, if I happen to walk into you, okay. But it seems like they're on purpose going about exactly behind me, and I'm like, okay, well, I'm backing up into you then. So, thanks. Thanks for the damage of the new cake. Also, Explosivo is fantastic. I didn't mention it, but so far, with the weaker items, huh? Every single item I have had has been good. 
Because if you don't know how this works, Exocebo gives you a... I think it is 60 dan- is that, I thought it was my spider. Oh, it's- It's, it's you, son of a bitch! That's right. Same asshole. Coming at me again. <sighs> anyway. The bomb damage. It does scale with our damage, but it has a- Thank you. It has a... Like, set modifier- Oh, uh, what do you call it? The base damage, too. I think it's like 60, 60 damage? 60? 100? I'm not sure. Wasn't looking at it. So. Point is... Randomly, we'll be doing a lot of damage. Lost, uh, something? I don't know. <clears throat> also, just not lose my, char my charges. Toxic Shock. That that's amazing to get, actually. So, yeah, um, this character is supposed to work where you get a ton of fires and wisps, and like your challenge is not to lose any of them, obviously. It's not the easiest in the world. You can still just, like, get shot a bunch or have someone walk into you and, like, just kill five fires at once. But. <laughs> Despite that, even though the strength of the run is supposed to be Lemington, like literally we're not using it at all. Like, to okay, Toxic Shock, first item we're actually using from it. That's a good item, I gotta admit. But, everything else is just items we have we own already, you know? Just pick them up ourselves, so. That's good and bad. It's bad because we're not being helped by the item that's supposed to help us, but it's good because we're not really relying on it either. So, it means we can still probably win without it, even though I probably want to you know, use it more often. It seems good. And actually, I really want to find it in the wild. I think that um, after I unlocked it, or after I won last game with her, spoilers, I won my last run, uh, I unlocked Wilmington just in basement somewhere. And this is a nice little bomb. Didn't get them all, apparently. And thanks for the hermit card. Mystery gift. Hmm. <clears throat> well, if there is a secret room. Wow, what do you know? Uh, or a curse room, I'm saying. Looking for just even a damage upgrade at this point. Even though, yes, the explosions are great. I'm just talking about like just a flat, regular something. A little nibble. Um, it's probably worth... Maybe I overrate luck in this game. <laughs> but it's a lucky penny. Pick it up. Uh, open. Okay, thank you. There's loss. I think that we're good to go now, right? Should be. Alright. I like my cube of meat and my, uh, toxic shock kind of like in the same space in there. Oh, wow. Really, huh? Abaddon? Wait, I used it before I used... Box of friends, no. This is awesome. Oh really? The Necronomicon. I guess you are giving me pretty bad items, huh? All right, all right. So every devil deal sucked, but all the items have been awesome. Okay, we're going to Polaroid. Going to Polaroid. Going to the chest. <clears throat> and if we can swing boss rush, yes, because like Lemmington just seems good in there. I can't say it is or not. But if I'm getting like a new item every three rooms, is that how it works? Every three rooms? Or if I get red hearts in the ground, of course. Probably want to use the lab down a little bit too. Alright, let's just keep on peppering the room. Eventually we get them all. And eventually we get one more damage upgrade. I'm telling you, one more is all you need. We're like pummeling for like 20 hits a second. Not really for like um, was that a red heart or a spirit heart? I think it was a red heart, actually. Random locust and killing enemy. Yeah, that seems like a pretty good damn or a pretty good item. Also a great item. Or I meant the first one's a trinket, actually. But, uh, yeah, I mean, more tier rate, perfect. More spirit hearts, amazing. <clears throat> I mean, I don't know. Can I get Epiphoria now? I can just, like, get insane in tier, uh, speed. But again, if I just got a little more damage, then I'd get a little bit more damage to my flies, my spiders, my everything. And I'll avoid cursing. I, mean, I think I'm, I'm kind of adhering too much to the TL Doctrine still, where I'm like ignoring the uh, curse rooms and stuff, so the boss trap rooms and stuff like that. For, I'm not saying no reason, I'm just like trying to get speed, I guess. It's not no reason. If I do hurry up, I could probably, maybe, uh, do boss rush, but I am cutting it close. 
Oh yeah, my damage is not good enough, huh? Okay, me out of here. There's nothing really worth it up there or down there, so let's keep going. It just kind of sucks when like my brain expects things to die and they just don't. Now, with that being said, it's probably like one hit. It probably wasn't like you know full health or anything, but still. Like, I thought I had a perfect death, perfect, perfect kill, but. Yeah, I guess the idea is just, just spritz as many as you can, have explosivo attached to it, and then that's it. That's your plan. Run away. We're, we're just kind of we're trying to infect them in this game. Eh, look better than last time. Still have not really used box of friends that much, but I'll show you now. Box of friends. Oh, <laughs> okay. Um, let's bookworm. I don't know how useful it actually is, but, you know, whatever. I'm gonna sneeze. That's in here, actually. Alright, I'm back. I uh, never had to stop midway through the combat before, so, uh... Yeah, I don't think it hurt or anything. It wouldn't matter that much, it's just a regular enemy. But were it like the womb, who knows, it could've got hit like twice and then lost all my HP or something like that. It's a bomb where Spirit Heart definitely is. But, why do that when you just fly over it? And... Uh, I'm pretty sure I'd rather have, uh, I'd rather have the Shears, because, I mean, if I stack up the blood, a plus for the boss rush, oh my gosh, but if I just use a bunch of times, imagine, just, uh, um, Joker card, okay, Come on, for now, pop that, um, use mascara, you say? Well, yeah, it definitely seems like you want to be using this item a lot, because, I mean, Ease Mascara is, like, perfect with this, what we have right now. I'm pretty sure we're still shooting faster than we would normally, uh, than, you know, than, than, than slowly. No, don't break my dear, my Mascara. Alright, right or lose, I lost something. Abaddon, it's fine. Here's, yeah, Abaddon doesn't matter anymore. Mom's Pearls, luck upgrade. I mean, I don't need to go in here, but I can. Sure. Yeah. And do we want to fight it? Why would I? Just go. We're running out of time. Mmm. Kind of close. If I if I go really fast, I probably could. But let's just pop the joker card real quick. And I don't think I want that actually. If I were earlier on the run, probably. But uh, I'm good. So, uh, just find the boss and leave, and then next floor, hopefully. I mean, if I just keep using Mascara, I have no worries here at all. Because it is... It's still doing way faster shooting than I would have ever would have, but doing more damage than I would have here. So, but the DPS is finally there, I think. Now, of course, I would like more, but... Uh, for now, we'll just... Just try to keep on moving. Now you're grabbing these uh, hearts, because each every, every single heart could be one more Shears or Lemington. No, 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 no. Son of a bitch. I can't even kill those things. Like, am I actually like bad damage? No, that seems pretty good. Look at this. Like, you're telling me I have bad damage when you've seen this one? Normally an enemy fight takes a lot longer than this. Well, I'm, I'm base damage, okay. Fine. Fair. It's probably average uh, if you just have items that are worth it. We still do, though. Like, don't get me wrong. We do have items that are worth it. We do use mascara though, which is like really good. Ooh, boomerang tears, that's interesting. Do not hurt my fires. How are we good yet? Okay, just one HP. Gotcha. All right, I think boomerang tears makes it even better. Now everything I miss comes back to me. And let's again. Uh, we might miss boss rush, but we'll do hush then, I guess, if we can. Because basically what I have to do to get boss rush, or, you know, I have to go to the, the, the floor, or go to the boss twice in a row pretty much from here. Oh, okay. I mean, lower damage, I'm not sure that's really worth it, but okay. Too late. Am I shooting two streams of... Uh, like, how's the, how's the double damage, or double tiers work? Is it, like, one more tier shooting, or is it doubling my current fire rate? Because if so, then, I don't know, it, it seems like amazing. But 
still. Uh, once I lose these Eve's Mascara, though, might haunt me a little bit. Come on. I'm not making it anymore. Not, not possible. Had a chance, but my range is so shit. Holy crap. Alright, well. I literally did an Emperor card. Emperor card and also to get down the floor right now. Habit. That's really good. I don't know. Emperor card? Emperor, Emperor card? No. Just uh, blow it out of the water. This would be a real test of our DPS. Because, uh, yeah, 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 yeah it, it's, it's good. Okay, it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Sure. I'm I'm trying to move as fast as possibly go. I really am. I do not think it's possible. I have a minute left. Keep going. Just just get lucky. Get lucky and you're fine. Just ignore hearts. Doesn't matter. It'd be nice, but time, time. Um, this might take a little while. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to get the hell out of here. That works. Come on, come on, come on. No. Not enough time. Oh, I'll try. I just can't. Oh, wait. Maybe, 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 maybe. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come in, come in. Mom, just die. Please. You're so close. No. Up here. Oh no. Mom, you screwed me over! Die! Alright, I tried my damnedest. Come on. That was his mom wasn't showing herself. Ain't my fault. Alright. And, uh, yeah, I'm pissed off, but let's go. I think I earned that one. Come on, you can give me like one second more to play with. Let's keep going. I mean, I'm not scared about losing anymore. Even though I lost his mascara, like it, it was just about getting the boss or something. Boss, boss rush on time. It was nothing about losing it. Cause uh, yeah, I mean, I'm almost glad now. I'm realizing that my I lost his mascara because um. Yeah. I, I can't believe it was <laughs> nothing enough to kill him. <laughs> anyway, we're doing 0.79 damage overall, but our bombs, our explosive damage, is, is, is still you know 60 times that or 60 plus that. So whatever, you know. I I think this is a fine build. I don't really need damage anymore. Just uh, more luck maybe to give me more explosive shots. That being said, that you know I have to actually stick them with the like. That, here's my mom took so long to kill. Is that she wasn't stick by any uh, shots. She had to just like, you know, get shot to death, I guess. But, oh well. Alright. Skip I did skip a I think item room. Come on. Fine. Wanna do that? Hmm. Tears up, range up. I mean, it's cool looking. All right, I'll try it for a room. I don't think I'm gonna keep it like this, but it is cool. I don't usually use this at all, so not find a way to. All right, and go this back up. Yeah. I don't know. I, I don't know which one has to, has to offer. To be honest with me. I'll be honest with me. What? I can't talk anymore. Just win. Okay. Just go to the go to the chest. Now we're going. If you happen to see Hush, you know, take it on, for sure. This seems good, though. Not sure I was lost, is that my reflection? I don't know. Also, I'm not using, I'm not using Lemington at all. Uh, Serpent's Kiss, though. Some poison, I guess. Like how, like, violently it's just shooting these, these little, like, beads. Alright. What's up? You're gonna be a pain in my ass, aren't you? Get the aim. Get, get the aiming down right. It's a little off to the left. 
seems like. All right, well. All right, I wasn't trying. I was trying to hit you, Mulandaji. It seems like. All right, and sure. This run, I'm not sure if it was coming anymore. I think my uh, my gunning after boss rush ruined the run a little bit. But it's okay. We'll just try to win fast. Make the best of it. Right. Just as long as they have a bomb attached to them somehow, they'll die eventually. Yeah, if they have several, of course, that's even better. No, I think I'm okay with keeping what I have. Like, for this, for having this low damage, this is still a pretty easy run. Yeah, 10 points out here. And I could push them in a bunch. Uh, slow your shots down. Should I just kill Isaac with my, uh, or Libby with, with my, uh, shears instead? It's possible. Or maybe the hush? Just, you know, hit hush with, like, 15 cube meats. Can't fly. Keep that in mind. Hey! And then my uh, tear blew up the wall. Right. It only said, I wasn't hey because I was pushing the button as the thing hit me. Yep, my, uh, there's, no, there's no commentary anymore. There, there's just shots shooting across the screen, a million miles an hour, covering the entire screen, but uh, doing no damage at all. Imagine if that Chub fight was just literally one second faster earlier. Not, not, not that one, like the other one. I had a, a different Chub fight, where I was like, over spikes, not, yeah, no, was, I know, the range wasn't working. Yeah. Oh. oh well. I guess it just means I'll play this character again, huh? You know, they're, I think this character's broken. OP. I think Samson's also pretty overpowered. I should play a little, play a little bit of him next, I don't know. See, not all the Tina characters are actually harder. Just some of them are. More of them are actually just kind of just different than harder. Okay, so we get shredded bits. It's just like having the s oh, there's some more of you. Uh -huh. Having the uh, the barrage of explosions is so good. And yeah, I'm taking a lot of damage right now. It's all bum rushing. So. Do we go for Hush? Or go for just winning? Hmm. All right. Just because I want there to be some challenge, otherwise I just win. Obviously, I just go to Isaac and win. Let's just try to make it hard for ourselves and maybe lose. Curse of the Unknown. Okay, I'm glad it wasn't Curse of the Can't See. Bloody Lust. That might be pretty good. I guess I'll take this. <laughs> Alright, so I think I have like f six health? Six, yeah, buy that too. And then boom, boom, boom. Oh, okay, I don't, I don't have keys. Oh, a lot of hearts though. It's crazy that like, getting two red hearts is like literally a full charge of this item. And that is pretty good too. All right, so I think we can beat the hush pretty easily. Even if we get hit a bunch, it's fine. Uh, I guess buy that. I don't know. Why not? Let's go. But first, you give him a little this and a little this and a little this and a little this and a little this. <laughs> Just trying to you know, get it split out. I guess definitely will make these a range now. And I think the explosions will also help with boss armor. Now I'm still wondering, like, do I want to just go all out right now and just blast them with like 15 of my uh, my friends? Definitely keep dodging too. You gotta, you definitely have to dodge. It's part of the game. But yeah, you're just getting explosive of the bitch out of you. 
don't think it's done that much though. The the friends I have. Oddly enough. The explosions are definitely, but my friends aren't. Who cares? I don't know. Okay. It's steadily going down. Not sure where it's lost, but you know. Yeah, maybe kill some of the enemies around me or something. You're half dead. That's something. Well, I'm not in explosion range is all I care about. Can I explain? Yeah, explosion can definitely hurt you. Also, always hard to know whose shots are mine, whose aren't, but obviously mine aren't purple, so that's one thing I can, I can know. Yeah, I'm not really sure the DPS on these uh, these friends are. Hey, what are you doing? Faster than me. Alright, you're dead. Yeah, that was still really, really easy. Um, I'm not sure if I'm dead, though. I mean, I could be dead. I probably have, like, what, two hits left? Three hits? I don't know. Oh, five. Not even close. Alright. We had the devil card. <laughs> Didn't use the devil card. That's hilarious. Maybe we could have had more damage. Alright. Now, we obviously just win. Come on. Uh, if we can be hush, we can beat anything. I also need to be hush pretty fast, too. So, you know what? It made up for the boss rush missing. Missing the boss rush, I guess. Plus, you, usually when you do boss rush, you can't make hush anyway because killing boss rush can take like five minutes or something. And uh, that five minutes could put you over time for hush. Oh, well. You know what? I think part of it was that I didn't even. Until the last floor when I was trying for boss rush, I didn't actually believe I could make it. But then when I found the, bo the boss so quickly, I'm like, oh shit. Awesome. Alright, well, hopefully we'll. Eventually kill these things with the ball steel, of course. Sure but belly button. Was there an item from that? <laughs> I don't know. Well, if we make it to the boss, we win. For sure. Four health. I don't know. It's, it's a coin toss. Why? Because the boss has moments of invincibility. Now, I, I also have moments of invincibility. So I'll pull the rig. Actually, I'm realizing Polaroid is guaranteed as good with this character. Because always, it'll always be. Are you serious? It'll always be uh, activating on Speed Hearts. Can't reach that. Can I hit the. No? <laughs> I, I could use the pinking shears, but. I might on this room actually not there. Ooh, you're also guarded by a light. Interesting. I mean, sure, more tears. Looking for more HP actually, though. No. I like how he just has a ring around him forever. Is he invincible forever? Can you just think bounce, bounce off of him? Graphical glitch, you say? <sighs> I never Alright, well, that kind of sucked. Why did it suck? Because for this room, you have to stand still to dodge the, you know, this thing in the middle. And when you do stand still, you get blasted by laser beams or from, you know, heaven's light. Alright, I'm probably going to die in this room. Why? Why am I gonna die? Why am I gonna die? It's because I'm holding this freaking trinket still. It's not. It's not worth it. <laughs> it's not worth anything. Um, use this. Buy a box. And now I can actually direct my tears. And I guess we have to. Just check. Money. Okay. Well, I mean, even if it's just um hush, it's still an accomplishment. Look how the, the bar is being moved lower and lower. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. What is that? Two of spades, you say? Um, this isn't fun. Go! Uh -huh. Okay, as long as we killed those things first, I think we're fine. Probably we'll still die to Isaac, though, if I had a guess. You're not naked. You, you can't even touch me. <laughs> This boss uh, will be knocked back, knocked back into oblivion. I mean, I got a golden key. Ooh, uh, golden key proved pay, prove fruitful because uh, need another HP. We're gonna win. So the good, the 
Okay, the helpful part of the trinket I had was that it was actually spreading pretty much everything with um, Explosivo. Now I have to actually, like, you know, manually aim myself, aim my Explosivo at things, but, you know, it's okay. It's fine. Slow effect. Ooh. Yeah. Alright. Just have enough now for one Polaroid hit. So hopefully I can get that for boss. Let me find another... Oh, oh, I hate this room. Um, die? <laughs> Why? Because, uh... Good hit before, I guess. I don't know. Maybe. A little bit, isn't it? How's that? Ah. Alright, uh, we're actually destroying Isaac. Didn't realize it was that strong. Holy crap. Wow. Well, uh, here we go. So yeah, I would say that the almond milk is a pretty good, like it affected the run pretty well. Of course, not because of one. Stitches, no. Undefined. Okay, interesting. Bobby, uh, dog tooth. Just find a blue baby. Just little drive by slowing effects. Still only a point nine damage. I probably should have tried harder to keep ma uh, use, use mascara, but well, we're fine. We're good. Hold in. I lost something there. Just, just kill a monster. I don't know where you are. Monster. Oh. And more items, please. We're very much like. Okay, fine. Oh, Rubber Cement, and that's really cool. I'll pop one of these in there just to uh, help out a little bit, and this didn't matter at all because once I exploded you, it's fine. Yeah, the explosion is just, it's just unreal. So yeah, I mean, if we could just find you, the boss. Oh, hey, this one, he's the one teleport behind you. Class teleport behind boss. A revenge on you. You didn't get teleport me. Um, I think if we fully concentrate a whole burst, we can kill one of these. Or, you know, I'm say it, it just explodes. Of course, that, that also works. So I heard dog, dog uh, tooth over here. Nope. Maybe it is above this chest. Oh, yeah. Oh my god. Well, better or for worse. Uh, what? Oh, you were a freaking spike chest? I can't even see past the, uh, what do you call it? Could pass the dude. All right, well, we could just boom ourselves any moment, any moment here, of course. Get boomed. <laughs> uh, piggy bank, not good. It's fine, whatever. And uh, just don't get boomed. That's the idea. Do not get boomed. And look for HP. These are my, my flames, I believe. One health would be so helpful here. Just one. Just one HP. Our damage is off the chain right now. Like, it, it is just absolutely insane. Like, holy crap. Okay, that was close. Don't hurt me, right? Don't hurt me. I don't think so. Okay, good. Make sure. Um, just stay from the skulls. Nope. Couldn't do it. Oh well. I mean, that was kind of like a suicide, suicide bomber from the start with like how often I was shooting the uh, those rapid fire explosive tears, fire mine tears. So if I even killed them, they probably would have bumped my face. I had to basically dodge the skulls. And I'm dodging the, the white skulls while these things are flying towards me. A lot of variables move parts to make up for, so I guess fine. If I didn't get the one spike chest, I probably could have won, but uh, you know, I'll play this character again. I'll have to do boss rush and I guess the chest, so yeah, still good. Still got a lot of, a lot of things, uh, no, it's all, it's nothing.